We have already surrendered too much. Now they want more. Meat, cloth, medicine. People in the city need these things. We ask for no more than you can give. This endless night, it drains us. Our resources are spread too thin. What you give to them, you take from the mouths of our citizens. All right. That's enough. My Koro was firm. I am to provide for the Elixni as if they were our own people. Our own people. Lakshmi was right. You are too political an animal, Osiris. The House of Light. We wish to destroy the Vax. To aid the Guardian. Same as you. Yes? Do not start with this. Tell me, Mithras. Were I in one of your cities, would you bow to all of my demands? We would give you anything you asked for. Because you are so generous? Because we would wish to live. I see. <laughs> you are fighting for your people as I would fight for mine, yes? It is true. Split the supplies as Ikora says. Anything to make this false night pass more quickly. Interesting. People of the last city, Commander Zavala and I have been touched by the generosity and kindness you've shown toward our new Elixni neighbors. We also understand the reluctance some have shown toward their resettlement. To those who mistrust our arrangement, let me remind you that this very city was founded by refugees. We sought shelter not only from alien aggressors, but from other humans the bandits and warlords that profited from our suffering. So it is with the Elixni. For the first time in our shared history, we need the Elixni, and they need us. Together with Mithrax and his sacred splicers, we can end the endless night. But only if we stand united for the betterment of all. <laughs> 